new series tonight. It's going to be um, T oh, bollocks. Hey fellas, new series tonight. This will be TBF. It's two beers Friday, and we've got two offerings of wheat beers today from Mr. Ann Rogerson and Frank Holbrew 77. Um, here's the bottle, we'll come have a look. And um, it's not a direct comparison, it's summer type beer, knock this off. Um, my favourite song at the moment, Kasabian. Right, so what I'm going to do, um, I'm setting this wheat beer, no information whatsoever, so cheers, Ant. and Frank's own brew. American wheat. So what I'm going to do is a head to head, no marks, anything like that. And I think Frank is the American wheat from the Bible. And I think Hans is based similar on it. And I think they both do use liquid yeast. If you guys can correct me, but I'm pretty sure you both do. So right, straight away we've got um we'll see the, the Cooper's bottles and the new generation of the site. Um Ants it's pretty tight. Frank's is wow. So I'll open Frank's down here. Um, no wheat base, should be highly carbonated, I'm not bothered about that, so we'll just open Frank's down there. It should be a nice this, that, yep. Lovely bit of cannon smoke there. Not too bad. That's Frank, some low pants. This one's at the camera. Probably can of smoke as well. See in the combination right. So we're going to keep ants to my left and Frank's to the right for no particular reason. So I'll put ants first. Um, cheers, fellas. Got exactly the same kind of glass. I say it's not a direct comparison. Uh, slight tinge of. No, um, that's great. Almost like a red singe in there. Has dissipated. The carbonation is there. That's ants. I'm gonna go for Frankie Boys. No, yeah. I'm just noticing on the sink there's a bit of um, motion going on there, so we'll pull it down there. Um, Frank's is, was more carbonated, I didn't know that. You might kill me for trying these two head to head, right? Put a bit more in there. Now you got some yeast in that one in France, not a bollard. Uh, right, um, straight away, there's a difference. Hans is darker, they both. Uh, Frank's is a lot more murky. Um, Carbonated there, Frank's streaming up. Uh, Ant's streaming up, and Frank's is quite steady. Uh, appearance. To me, I'll give it to Frank. So it's not a direct comparison and um I may not think we're doing this but I'm gonna do this every week or when I do it on a Friday. Um the same style of beer, maybe not exactly the same but um or similar style like a stout bit or whatever. Um be a homebrew and maybe two commercials or one commercial one homebrew so um so it takes on so it's T B F is two beers Friday. Right, um, the carbonation on there, Ants is just streaming up there. So, why is that not holding head? And the glass is exactly the same. Frank's is calming down. So, right, get a sniff of Ants first. Pure wheat on there, and I'm also guessing. Can you hear that? The action on that. Look at Beautiful. Look at that. Can hear it. And also, it's almost like a fruity tone. So, what is used? Hops which promotes that kind of thing, or in something like that. I don't know. And Frank's, well, it was initially more carbonated, it has seemed to calm down. Um, Dive into Frank's first. Cheers, Frank. Wheat's there straight away. Um, 
and get a little bit of spice on there um, some citrus in there or in something like that look at the notes here because I'm not all favour of these um, this citrus, I'm going to give you this, this citrus and this straight away so that's the American wheat beer and Frank's does look quite similar to that it's not a wheat beer glass I've got I've got two the same anyway but um, yep um, so it's about this this hazy refreshing beer packed with exuberant citrus flavours and got straight away aromas but imparted by powerful American hops and yeast on the eight, so why yeast? 10 10. I'm not sure where Frank did use that or did he use a, uh, a WB06 something like that from Mantis, I don't know. I think he did use the um, liquid, <coughs> pardon me, combination attack. Right, let's dive into ants. Don't know why. Uh, I think these glasses, they are the same glass, not the same glass obviously, the same type of glass, but was this in the soap I don't know in the sink let's have a dive in oh, that's that, that's getting there it's more tangy that it sounds it's almost like a more more sour is it so I say um that's more that's more sharp than Frank's. Frank's got more, say, more depth to it almost, if you can understand that. Um, Roma on that. Tons on that. I'm getting his wheat there, and he's also is his slight citrus. It's not, it's not as pr uh, pronounced as one of Frank. Trying to get straight away and that is more more subtle, which is the uh, beautiful for, for uh, Mr. Rogerson. Um, right, that one again. It's lighter in body, lighter in feel. The carbonation is actually sharper, although there's not as much head as one in Frank's. Um, and this again. There's more body to Frank's. Um, a better mouth feel in my opinion. And also more more rounded, should I say? But This is more spring, and to, to me, ants is more summer, if that makes any sense. Both great bears. Ants is slightly clearer, and Frank's has a better head retention. Other than that, um, two cracking bears. I'm just done a swirl on ants there. Try again because that head's coming. The way I pour it, that, that's better. That looks very similar now, head wise. You can see there. Um, so, Hans is slightly clearer, more carbonated, and Frank's is more to me, it's more like a a wheaty wheat beer. Makes any sense? Uh, right, so. Should I score them against each other? Because, tell you what, these, these two brewers. Uh, YouTubers, whatever you want to call them, but fantastic guys. And these, you may may not know it in the other parts of the world, but in the UK, these two lots of, well, renowned for being tight. And one is Yorkshire, and one is Scottish. But these two fellas belie that because they're both really generous people. Not in also. Not in terms of just giving away beers in the comment comments, reunion of the beers as well, something like that. Um, 
been a pleasure to try them both. I mean, it's, cut, it's killed two birds with one stone because I'm off on, uh, on the sun this Friday tonight. So I want to do two birds together. Um, TBF, and I think it's been a success that. Um, oh God, I'll tell you what, I just can't. You know, it's football pundits sit on the fence. I feel like that because I can't. I find it hard to choose between the two. Um, I'd have to drink them all, all day. Because um, roasting or not, I would go for ants, highly carbonation, and more. More refreshing thing. I've just got loads of orange on there now, and I'm also getting a bit of grapefruit. As I say, I'm not sure what I'm doing with this. And Frank's, he's more full bodied, I would say it's more. It's more early spring, autumn. Um, should I really do it? Which one I prefer? It's so difficult, this. Um, and the guys won't thank me if I didn't. If I didn't um, you know, give a result and should we say any time of year, right? Which one do I prefer? That's Ants, that's Frank's. I think Frank's has looked slightly better. Ants is. The cabinet. I'm also getting like a, like a tart, almost like a a raspberry almost like a ciderish aspect on that for the best of um, middle of summer ants would win every day but no real, real round beer I'm afraid it's going to be Frank's so uh, cheers fellas thanks ants and thanks Frank for watching don't mean to be rude by the comparisons, but I do actually prefer uh, Frank's beer, and I'm, I'm sure Ant would be the first to um, congratulate Frank. Um, and I've had both beers, and I've had both beers of styles from both of them. They're both fantastic beers, and I come. It's hard to differentiate, but you know, if you want to choose one, and that, for this series, you know. To be a Friday, you've got to, you've got to choose one or the other. I'm going to choose Frank's tonight. So, cheers, folks! Thanks for watching. Both fantastic beers. I'm not knocking either of them because you know, I had a early on I had a whole garden, which is a decent beer, but you know, um, and whole garden. Any any commercial beer is produced. Um, Price per pint, price per litre. But these, us, well, you, me, us home brewers, we can do what we want, can't we? We can add the hops we want, the grains we want. We're not to a price point, are we? Um, but yeah. Cheers, fellas. Two Bears Friday, number one, and Mr. Uh, Frank's Homer 77. Just edges it, and thanks, Ant, and uh, catch you later.